Well, hello, 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 and hello, uh, and how you doing? Uh, good afternoon, first and foremost. Anyhow, I'm just sound by. Y'all know me, I gotta do a video. I like doing videos. Like I said, it's my therapy, and it's something I like to do. I don't do videos for views, likes, or trying to be an internet sensation, or none of that bullshit. I just like to do it. It's my page, and you know, sometimes... The way I like to talk and the way my mouth is set up, I don't have time to be, you know, the, the turning, you know, trigger fingers into Twitter fingers. <laughs> so I like to take my time and leave videos. They get more clear when you can talk and keep it moving. But um, anyhow, um, as everybody know, I am a Dr. Phil freak. Okay? I love watching Dr. Phil right after the talk because, you know, I watch the Bold and Beautiful, then the talk. And all in with um, Cheryl Underwood and them. And then I watch his Dr. Phil. Now, the episode I want to touch top is on. It's not the day. It came on a um, couple of days ago. And um, I just wanted to say something about it. I had made a video before about relationships and all that. And why relationships don't work. And why you get hurt the way you do women. And all that good shit. But court is adjourned. I'm back by popular demand. Now, this is, like I said again, this is, I don't know how I be saying stuff, but this is no shade, no tea. I'm just going to keep it 1,000, not 100, 1,000, bitch. First and foremost, the topic was, it was a young lady on there. Y'all may have seen it if y'all watch Dr. Phil Heavy like I do. The topic was a young girl was on there and she was dating her, you know, boyfriend or whatever. Make a long story short, you know how it go. She wanted to confront him like she was on Moy or something. She wanted some help. With their relationship. But anyhow, after everything that he done to her, she wound up marrying him anyhow. Thought, I guess that was going to change something. Then she had a baby by him. Thought that was going to change something. And that cycle, I just see it all the time like a washing machine. I'm just sitting here like, I could have helped you, girl. You're so fucking stupid. Women are so fucking stupid. But if the shoe don't fit, then don't wear it. I'm just, you know who you are. If you are stupid. A dumb ass dot. A dumb thought. Now... You signs that you are a thought, you'll know that you're a thought because you're stupid. The dumb shit you put up with, the dumb shit you do for men, the dumb they they are let me tell you, the gold rule is one I'ma say this one rule before I go any further. I don't want to take up twenty minutes of a video. The golden rule is I always say this, and this goes on both sides for man or woman. Can't no motherfucking body do no more than you I mean no more to you than you allowed. Okay? So when she was sitting there crying and stuff, I couldn't have no sympathy. She was like, and he cheated with my girl, my home girl. He cheated with this one and he made this one pregnant. And he did this and he did that. And like Dr. Phil said, when he did it the first fucking time, you stayed. That's why you're going through what you're going through. If it's easy cheesy, they're going to do it again. Once a liar, always a liar. Once a cheater, always a cheater. Once a manipulator, always a manipulator. Flat the fuck out. Why do you think I'm single? I don't got time. I have real, real, real low tolerance for bullshit. I'd rather be single than to put myself in a relationship where though I'm making it, trying to make something out of nothing. Signs that you are a fat woman, you're too easy. You don't close your pussy and your legs. You don't clink, clink. You're sitting here giving every man you meet your pussy. Just like my kid's mother. That's why she got all them kids and no man in her life. You know, yes, I said it. Y'all stupid. Y'all stupid from here. And stop using that fucking excuse. Oh, I didn't have a father that teach me how to be a young girl or a young lady. That's played the fuck out. I'm tired of everybody using that for a fucking crutch. It's time to get your legs fixed and keep it moving. But y'all make yourself too vulnerable, easy, and stupid. You are a thought when you're sitting here doing shit unnecessary. A thought ain't just that hole over there. A thought is a weak-minded, low self-esteem, stupid-ass bitch. You're sitting there knowing damn well this man don't love you, and you're trying to make a relationship out of not a, a relationship that ain't gonna never happen. It's never going to be. He don't want you. You stupid bitch. You can't see through the through the smoke. Is that black? You can't see through it. If you're sitting there paying men's cards for jail, green dot cards, and all that shit over the jails and all that, you a thought. You're stupid. He and that fucking men, but you sending him green dot cards. And taking him socks and shit for court. He calling you tomorrow. Yeah, babe, call my motherfucking mans and them. Call this one, do this. He got you being a secretary and all that. If he cared anything about you, when he get out of jail the first time, 
he would come home, get his shit together, get him a job, and keep his, his head up and be a real motherfucking man. A man is not a man because he's on that damn corner. So you set yourself up for failure. If he gave a fuck about you and your children, he wouldn't have you on the run tour. And I don't mean what Beyonce and Jay-Z. You stupid as shit. He don't give a fuck about you because you're putting up your life in jeopardy, your kids' freedom, because you're not mentally, physically, and emotionally attached to your kids because you're worrying about his ass, what he need and what he doing. You're putting your house up for jeopardy because it can get raided or anything while he in jail because he's he putting you at harm nation. But this, this is what I'm talking about. You stick with these type of men. And tell about, Lord Jesus, I want me a real man. When? A trash ass man is cutting up your space for God to even send you something that'll help you and love you. Women, if y'all sitting here paying men's cell phone bills and he don't live with you, I'm so sick of saying that she was like, well, I'm paying his bills because he going through a hard time. Bitch, he don't even spend holidays with you. He don't even sleep with you. She said he out of jail, but he act like he stayed. He, the whole time he was staying over his mother's house, but the whole time he was fucking everybody. But you still paying his bills. Oh my God, bitch. And you don't see the problem? She was sitting there paying this man bill. Women, if, you, if you're paying a man's cell phone bill, now don't get me wrong. If he married to him, you married to this man. And y'all live together, and he helping paying that mortgage or that rent and that car payment and that car insurance, then that's a different story. Then it can be 50 50. I got your back, baby. But if he not living with you, he come to dick you down when the fuck he get ready, and he fucking anybody he want. Your dumb ass sitting there catching STDs for his dumb ass, or sitting there acting like you don't know he cheating on you tomorrow. I know he not cheating. He not cheating. You's a stupid hoe. He don't have time for you on holidays. He ain't paying none of your fucking bills. What are you paying his cell phone bill for? So he can call you? Women just stupid. See, I'm raising a daughter. That's why this video, I'm so harsh about it. Because I'm not fucking tolerating my daughter having a little self esteem for no motherfucking bum ass nigga. Women, do you know what a real man is? A real man helps and provide. He's the king of the castle. He helps take care of you. He cooks. He cleans. He comes to your every need. He runs to you. He rushes to you. He treats you like a queen. Bitch, not like a slave. Why do y'all women set yourself up for failure? Ain't that much heart in the world. Ain't that much hurt in the world. You don't sit there and give a man all your love, heart and mind and soul and money and all that thinking that's going to make a man. If a man really love you, you should be able to feel it. Not trying to make a relationship out of a relationship. Not trying to build something that's never going to be. Stop living in fucking la la land, bitch, and wake the fuck up. Like the song say, I had to wake up. Stop living in a dream. You have low self-esteem. I'm sorry. What else is the excuse? You're lonely. You're lonely, got low self-esteem, and you're miserable. And you're settling for less when you can have the best. I will, if I was a woman, I'd rather save my pussy. I would rather save my damn self and then wait for the right man to sweep me on my feet. I want to be like Tina Turner and Eve, the rapper Eve. See how that man is a millionaire? And I'm not saying money is everything and cars and all that, but at least somebody, he got something. I'm not saying he ain't going to give you problems, but at least this man came to me and said, babe, here's a rock on your finger. Like Beyonce husband, they may go through their problem, but at least Jay-Z got money. She got her own money, but like she said, bitch, I'm independent. You know, I want a man. Fuck that. You'll be sitting here getting rich off my goddamn millions. Beyonce said, not today, bitch. You know, not bitch, miss, not miss, bitch. You're not going to be Mrs. Clippy. Women, please, all these powerful women you see out here in this world, open with me, all of them, and you don't have no enthusiasm to do better, you need to wake the fuck up and stop being a stupid ass, thought ass, dumb ass, Project brain, cluttered mind, dumb ass, drug dealing men, dumb ass men, using men, fake ass pimp men, and grow the fuck up. Is this the best you could do? Why do you think your kids don't like you? Because you ain't worrying about them. All you worrying about is your man all the time. I'm serious. Ain't no shade. This ain't no direct shot. I'm just keep, keeping it real. I couldn't have no sympathy for this woman. She was crying and everything. He didn't even share to you. He's sitting there like... And he said it. You deal with it. As long as y'all dumb ass women deal with it. Let me tell y'all something. They're going to continuously hurt you. Why not? You're selling it for it. You're dealing with it. Just like when a man put their hand on you. The first time he put, your, put his hand on you, that's when you should have said, I'm out of here. I, fuck that holding on. If I was a woman, I'm not holding on to shit.
I ain't made no goddamn fat, no dot, and no all that shit, no duck, no chicken here for you. Bitch, don't you put your hand on the boat in the beautiful. Why don't you raise your hand? If I can't beat you and I'll stab this bitch, let him know, don't you ever put your hand on me. See, I come from a strong mother. My mother ain't let no man put their hands on her. You understand? Bitch, put your hand on my mother. Mama will pop right in your motherfucking face, bitch. You understand? You shouldn't let a man treat you like shit. Grow the fuck up and wake up, women. This is your fault your heart is hurting. This is your fault you got sorry baby fathers. I don't want to hear another woman say, I got a sorry-ass baby father. No, you a sorry-ass bitch. I always say this for dealing with his sorry ass. Now, I know, don't get me wrong. I know sometimes shit don't unfold and you don't know all his secrets because I am I got trapped in the gondola. So I ain't preaching to y'all like I ain't make no mistakes. I can't preach it if I didn't walk it. I'm like Mary J. Blige. I told y'all I wear my heart on my sleeve and I'm a man. I got trapped. My kid's mother. That sorry bitch. Yes. Child, and I had two of them because I went back after the first one. If I both broke up with her, everybody was telling me what she was doing to me, but I kept going back. So I lived and I learned, learned and I lived. So what I'm saying to you, I'm not bashing nobody, but you get older, you get wiser. Learn from your mistakes and stop sitting here selling for less. That's why I'm single because I'm like, you know what? It's time to love just Hollywood. It's time to love me. If, let me tell you something. You can't love nobody or accept love in you until you love your motherfucking self. You don't love yourself. That's why you keep settling for that shit. That's why you're dealing with people's bullshit. Because you don't know what love is. You don't know what love is. It's not love for a man to hurt you. It's not love for a man to cheat on you. It's not love for a man just to fuck you when he wants to. If you open your door or you're giving a man a key to your house and he come fuck you and then leave, you a free prostitute. You're a free prostitute. You are an easy 7-Eleven open when he wants you to. Ain't no man getting no key to my house. If I was a woman, you ain't key to what? Key to my house for what? You paying the mortgage? Oh, okay. If I, if you got a key to my shit, you must be on my lease. And you must live with me. And at night, you must sleep with me. If you ain't living under my roof 24-7, bitch, you don't get no key to my treasure. You got me fucked all the way up. And as a man, I'm a strong-ass man. Men or women, I don't play no games. That's why I'm single. My kids will not see me in here arguing. My kids ain't going to see me in here going through lottie daddy and somebody. I'm real cordial and very cautious of what I do. Because I'm setting an example. Y'all fucking in front of y'all children and shit like these kids don't know. Don't invite nobody over your damn house in front of your damn children. It's not what you do, it's how you do it. Why right today in school? Oh, going on a weekend? Get a babysitter and tell that motherfucker I'll meet you at the hotel. Don't get no man to no key to your damn house if he not damn, if he not um your husband or something. No. Don't get that damn man no key to your house. Cause you know that's not their stepfather. Stop having y'all children call these motherfucking clown ass pedophiles, these fucking pedophile rapist motherfuckers, they father. You ain't earned that. I tell anybody, you gotta earn shit with me. You don't just, and I'm gonna tell you another secret. Stop going backwards and go forward. If they your ex, they your ex for a fucking reason, you dumb bitch. We broke up. Let's be cordial, friends. Let's be very cautious. We can talk. We can say what's up. But ain't no more of that, 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 that. No, you ain't getting up in my bed. For what? That's confusing my kids. They thinking, okay, this is stepmom. Is this stepmom? No, baby, that's not stepmom. That's a friend of us. That's a friend of me or a friend of us. However you want to put it. I play no game. I can set an example for a lot of men and women. But when they judge a book by its cover, they don't see the strength in me. I play no game. My kids, my God, and myself is the first three loves of my life. I play no motherfucking game. If it ain't my kids ain't happy and I'm not happy, God ain't pleased, I don't give a fuck about nothing else. That's why I don't tolerate it. You're not going to destroy my home. Be careful what you entertain in your house. You see that girl? I got killed by her boyfriend, and he killed the son, too. Act like you didn't see the news. That's the shit y'all gonna set yourself up for. Failure. Because you're stupid. Get a good piece of dick, and you're whipped. Get a good piece of dick, and you whipped. You's a stupid bitch. Grow the fuck up. You dumb assholes. That's why when I meet women, they don't even know how to accept a good man like me that provide, cook, clean, and all that. Because they so used to being trashed and dug, they carry the baggage with them. Like the song say, all this baggage with me, don't want to make you pay for what somebody else has done to me. 
I don't know what to do. Mary J. Blige sing that song on the breakthrough. It's called Baggage. That's what you're dragging with you. That's why women can't accept a good man like me. That, now, when I get with a woman, you know what they try to do? Play me because I'm too soft. I'm too calm and ready to love you, ready to give you, to show you how to wine and dine you. But you're so used to being treated like trash, you accept that. So that's why I'm single. You ain't going to treat me like shit. I'm too beautiful for that bullshit. Stay in your lane. But like I say, men and women, step your game up and grow the fuck up. But like I say, no shade, no tea. If you, if that's what you're comfortable with being, a low-budget tramp, then do so. Anyhow, I took up enough of your time. Hated or love it, love it or hate it. You know it came directly from my mouth. And you know my vlogs, my videos. This is what I give. Lamonta Notorious Hollywood. Wear that smile on your face. And know that you are somebody. Because when God made your dumb ass, he didn't make no trash. He didn't make no junk. Because I know when he made me, he didn't make no junk. Y'all have a blessed day. If it hurts you, then you know you need to do something about it. Up your game, women. Okay, if it hurts you, then there's something wrong with you. Up your game, bitch. Get a real man and stop letting him clutter up your space. Storage is free. I mean, storage is not free. Open up there and throw that shit out. Okay, and learn to find you a real man. Okay, men, find a real woman because men, you get hurt too because you fucking with thoughts and dumbass budget women too. So I'm here for both y'all, candidate. How you doing? And anyhow, I'm out.